And uh, first of all, I would like to apologize to the media because uh, due to some emergencies, Mr. KTR Garu and Mr. Vishal couldn't make it today. But as we all know, the show must go on. So ladies and gentlemen, once again, a very good afternoon. My name is Himani Singh and I'd like to welcome you all to Hyderabad Street Circuit launch and F3 car launch. Well, it's an absolute pleasure to be a part of this event today because this is the first of its kind event that we are hosting in India because Hyderabad being the first city to be building and launching FIA graded street circuit for Formula Regional Car Racing. Well, we have all had uh, our share of uh, adrenal rush while we watch uh, our favorite racers racing in the Formula Car Racing. But it's now time to experience the exhilarating event in our very own country. Well, in the motorsports industry, we are now reaching a milestone because we are bringing you to the fastest sports event in India. And to kick stage, Mrs. Ra please have them on stage and everybody please. Well, this being a platform which will help our young and talented racers of our country to be visible on the world map. So, wow, this really is a big deal. Once again, everybody, we have the ladies on the stage. Can we have a huge round of applause as we are now kickstarting the event with auspicious lighting of the lamp? Once again, everybody, can we have a huge round of applause? We are kickstarting this historic event in the city of Nizam, Hyderabad. Thank you so much, ladies. Thank you. I would now request you to kindly take your seats. Thank you so much. Well, this is also an event which believes in giving equal opportunities to women and men. And uh, guess what? I cannot wait to know more about this event. And uh, it's time to call our guests on the stage who will tell us more about what's happening today. How is this event going to progress? How is, the, how is history going to be made in our country in motorsports industry? And for that, I would li now like to invite on stage Mr. Akhilesh Reddy, the chairman of RPPL. I would kindly ask him to step forward. Everybody, a huge round of applause for Mr. Akhilesh Reddy. When you see around the globe, the mouth is... 
protection of wealth. When you see so few halves and so many half-nots, when you see the greed and the concentration of power. Well, ladies and gentlemen, um, you have right here the man behind putting this whole event together, Mr. Akhilesh Reddy. Can we once again have a huge round of applause for him? Come on. All right, uh, next I would like to invite on stage Mr. P.P. Reddy Garu. Can we have Mr. P.P. Reddy Garu? Welcome, sir. Ladies and gentlemen, history is being created right here, right now. And uh, moving on, I would now like to invite Mr. Krishna Reddy Garu on the stage. Mr. Aditya and Mr. Arman, they are the joint managing directors of Racing Promotions Private Limited. Everybody, a huge round of applause. And next, I would like to invite Mr. Gopi Garu. Can we have Mr. Gopi Garu on stage, please? Well, as I mentioned earlier, th today, 
Rather, this event is going to be historic in the motorsports industry of India. But you know what? First of all, let's take a look at how motorsports history of India has been so far. So can we please have the video on the screen? There is a saying that motorsport began as soon as the second car in the world was made. And in fact, races or time trials were designed to prove to the world that the car was here to stay. In India, the first time trials or races can be traced back to well over 120 years ago. Truly, the heyday of Indian motorsports was in the 70s and 80s, where airfields were converted to racetracks. Everything from specially designed race cars to heavily modified and even Formula One car has been raced in India till date. And today, we are here to witness another historic moment for the Indian motorsport landscape. A milestone, ladies and gentlemen, racing promotions brings to our shores for the first time ever, Formula Regional Racing. because Formula Regional Racing Championship is here in India. And uh, I would now like to invite Mr. Akhilesh Reddy, once again, the chairman of RPPL, to kindly address our gathering. Good evening, everybody. Thanks, everyone, whoever is here, for taking out your precious time and being here. I would like to thank Mr. Ketia Garu, who was unexpectedly, uh, he couldn't come here because of some other issues. But thank you, sir. Because of him, we were able to make the uh, street circuit possible. And I would like to thank Mr. P.P. Reddy Garu and Krishna Reddy Garu and my dad, always being a support and guiding me into a right path. And I feel really happy and blessed to be here, to have a family like this. So. I'll just get into the details of the event. So this is a great day for Indian motorsport. And I'm proud to make Hyderabad the center stage for this vision of ours. Our entire focus and ambition is focused in the development of motorsports and creating a platform for aspiring Indian racing drivers to earn FIA points to complete the highest level. I mean the Formula One, which is the highest level by investing in assets and infrastructure to help build and the fundamentals of the sports in India. We are also making our intention clear to make motorsports more accessible and affordable across all segments. Because there's a misconception in Indians especially, they think that the motorsport is a costly affair. But our trial here is to make it more affordable and get out the great talent which is hidden in India. So this will make India a hub for global motorsports, enabling an army of technicians, mechanics, and engineers to have a career in the motorsports. The formats which we will talk about later will help you understand how we are empowering women, giving equal opportunities, and making an entire ecosystem that is general neutral, as much as the vision and ambition is to create the next F1 drivers for India. And my promotional and my personal ambition to promote women racing drivers and have the first F1 woman driver from India. 80% see the motorsports as entertainment. But the idea is to legitimize the sports aspect of racing, where there is absolutely zero margin for error, and the physical plus mental fitness levels are higher than most other sports, which is an important factor in us choosing to invest in motorsports. We will also show through multiple programs and education to the ministry, why this requires greater recognition and support. FIA Super License Points affords us the unique opportunity to be the only sports league in India that is truly global in terms of creating world champions that can provide the propel talent to compete at the highest level. Would like to welcome the honorable guests, Mr. Krishna Retigaru, P.P. Retigaru, and Gopi Garu for gracing this occasion. 
So through the multiple programs and education, we are trying to uh, show that why this requires greater recognition and support. FIA Super License Points affords us the unique opportunity to be the only sport in India that is truly global in terms of creating world champions. Without further delay, I would like to give you the opportunity of our esteemed guests to grace this occasion and being a new era in motorsports. Thank you. Jai Hind. We are closing. Thank you so much, Mr. Akhilesh. Well, with promises to put our young and talented racers on the world map, Now, um, I'm going to request Mr. Krishna Reddy Garu to kindly step forward and unveil the street circuit of Hyderabad. Everyone, a huge round of applause. Good evening, friend. And my Colleague, press, friends also. Thanks for coming all the way on the Sunday. We are welcoming you. Just I'll take only five minutes. We are the MEL group. Everyone knows uh, in South India. We brought so many new technologies in India, mainly electrical buses, then later manufacturing of of offshore and onshore oil rigs and so many other new technologies we brought into India. Then that time Akhil requested me, why, not, why can't we do something to the youngsters and public? We don't have the F3 race, F1 race. I don't know about much about the races. I never seen also. This is the first time today I'm seeing. Then he told me, Hyderabad, Hyderabad is our place. We'll start local racing here. Then we requested KTR Garu and immediately he responded, he given clearance. Now, because of that, we are today we are here. Best of luck to the entire team. Thanks. Thank you all. Thank you. Can we please have the video on the screen, please? Welcome to India, the state of Telangana, and the new Hyderabad street circuit. Home to almost 7 million residents, Hyderabad is famous for its excellent cuisine, monuments, and temples, which include the Charmina and the Fort of Golconda. The 2.4 kilometer circuit winds its way through the streets of Lumbini Park alongside the Hussain Sagar Lake with eight challenging turns on a layout designed to promote close slip streaming and overtaking. The first straight heading up towards Turn 1 will be an area to look out for in particular, especially at the start of the race on lap 1 where the cars will be bunched close together going into this tight hairpin which leads onto another straight and turns 2 and 3. This sequence is all about precision, brushing the curbs before heading underneath the National Highway 44 flyover. 
Turn five is the last major overtaking opportunity on the lap, so expect to see lots of late lunges and cutbacks here as the cars jostle for position heading to the final couple of corners, preparing for another lap. Let's go on board now in a Formula 3 car for a lap of the circuit. Shifting up through the gears and onto the 500 metre long pit straight to start the lap. Stay in the middle of the track for the heavy braking zone of Turn 1, the tightest corner of the lap taken at just 40 kilometres per hour. Onto the 600 metre long back straight and the approach towards Turn 2 and 3 with the lake on the left hand side. Drivers will be reaching speeds of over 230 km per hour here before a quick dab of the brakes and across the kerbs, losing as little speed as possible through the sequence. A short burst towards turn four and underneath the flyover, leading onto another long straight where a likely overtaking opportunity awaits at turn five. The straight curves gently to the right, running parallel with the flyover before the next heavy braking zone where drivers will have to position their car strategically to either attack or defend in a racing situation. Now only the final chicane remains, but this is one of the trickiest sections of the lap. Slingshot your way through turn six and seven, close to the wall through turn eight, and across the line to complete a lap of the Hyderabad street circuit. Wow, can we have a huge, huge round of applause? Ladies and gentlemen, what you just saw is the first of its kind street circuit in India, in our very own city of Hyderabad. Now, that was amazing. Moving on, it's now time. Well, I have to tell you, the wait is finally over. The reason why we all have gathered here. The moment has arrived because now you are going to see the beauty. Well, it's now time to unveil the beautiful car, the gorgeous car that we have here. And for that, I would like to invite Mr. P. P. Reddy Garu. But uh, let's first quickly take a look at the video. Can we have the unveiling of car video, please? Was amazing and 
I can safely say what you're going to witness here right now is something you haven't seen before. And for that, I would like to invite Mr. P.P. Garu Reddy to kindly step forward and unveil P.P. Reddy Garu to unveil the beauty right now. to share the presentation with us. I would also request Mr. Akbar Ibrahim, FMCI president, to kindly step forward. I request him to kindly say a few words, address the gathering. a huge round of applause for Mr. Akbar. Listen, the energy cannot go down. This is the highest energy, energy sports event that we have in India. So we have to make sure that today at this event, our energy is at par. Ibrahim and Mr. Aditya Patel to share the presentation with us. Uh, distinguished honorary guests, media, ladies and gentlemen, and the whole of the RPPL team. 
Uh, it's a pleasure to be here for this inauguration and launch of the FIA certified Formula Regional uh, Series. And Hyderabad is now going to be one of the uh, first cities to conduct uh, FIA certified uh, championship race, which will go down in the uh, books of Indian motorsport history. I'd like to congratulate everybody in Team RPPL and all the people from Hyderabad for working hard to put this together. The Regional Formula 3 Championship is going to do a lot of good for the Indian motorsport community and <coughs> we will definitely see this platform enable many Indian drivers to reach higher echelons and in all probability have the next Formula 1 driver coming in from this championship and this series representing India. Thank you. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. And now I request Mr. Valaditya Patel and Mr. Arman to kindly give the presentation. Thank you. Uh, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Firstly, thank you all for being here today. My name is Aditya Patel. This is Arman Ibrahim. Um, and it's wonderful to see a great crowd. We are going to run through what Indian Motorsports is about, what we plan to do in the future, and you will find out more about why you are here today. Motorsport has come a long, long way since the first race, which was probably sometime in the late 1800s. Today, it is one of the most viewed sports in the world. 670 million dedicated viewers, a lot of household names when it comes to racing drivers like Lewis Hamilton, Fernando Alonso, of course, there's Michael Schumacher, Valentino Rossi, Formula One, Formula E, MotoGP, everybody loves motorsport now. But even in India, motorsport has grown. Motorsport has already come a long way. We have 60 million dedicated viewers for the sport itself. Uh, some recognizable household names. I'm sure you've all heard of people like Narayan Karthikeyan. There's Karun Chandok, Gaurav Gill, our very own Arman Ibrahim standing next to me. So a lot of race drivers who are also now household names in India. In 2019, we, RPPL, we launched India's first racing league. Arman Ibrahim and myself, as the founders, we both are race car drivers, or should I say were race car drivers. Maybe one day we'll race again. Still are, still are. Uh, but the first season was great. The pilot season was a huge success. We had great viewership. We were also broadcasted on Sony, uh, Sony Live, Sony Television. Um, and also had some great partners as well, MEIL being one of those partners, some great racing teams, big brands on board, just goes to show how much people love motorsport in the country. We were also recognized by the FIA, the president of the FIA, Jean Tort, uh, put in a few kind words for us. Like Akhil said earlier, gender equality is a huge part of what we do, men and women racing against each other, with each other as teams, so there's no segregation. And that's what made this really, really special. What next? Well, as racing promotions, we partnered with, of course, Akhilesh Reddy, who is now our chairman, and uh, Navjeet Gadok of the Gadok Group. Together, as a strong force, we were able to take motorsport to a completely different level, bring the Formula Regional car to India, and not just the Formula Regional car, but also the Formula 4 car, as well as the Wolf car for the Indian Racing League. So we've structured it in a way that it makes it a lot more easier for youngsters to climb the motorsport ladder. Earlier, it was a little difficult for people to understand or know where they wanted to go, but now we've got a pyramid system which makes it very, very easy. You start with karting, move up to Formula 4, Formula Regional. In the global stage, you've got FIA, F3, F2, and F1. And on the Indian stage, you've got the Indian Racing League, which is an aspirational championship for the youngsters. Not only are we about youngsters and racing drivers, but it's also about building in the sport, bringing in sponsors, bringing in investment from other countries, and also to give young engineers and mechanics an opportunity to be a part of motorsport. Everybody loves cars, everybody loves racing cars, and we are here to provide everybody the opportunity to be a part of the sport. I am now going to hand it over to Arman Ibrahim, who will take us through what our racing cars are all about. Well, the interesting, the interesting thing about what we're doing is we're getting a 
conglomerate of racing cars. So we're bringing a total of 43 cars, which is over three different categories. So our racing event, each event would have over six to seven races that would entertain the, the hell out of each of, and, and every one of you. Starting off with the Formula Regional Indian Championship, which is the first ever ever kind and the first official FI graded series that has come to India. And what we are offering here is 18 FI graded points, which helps you achieve your goal of, of, of getting a super license to, to drive a Formula One car. Now, once you've finished with that, we have the Formula Four cars, which again, you get another 12 points there. And this helps a total of 30 points, uh, which are eligible for the drivers. And you only need another 10 more to get the super license points. So as we move on, we move on to the Wolf racing cars, which will be used in the Indian Racing League. This is a franchise-based racing, racing league which started off in 2019 and has six different franchises competing against one another. We have four drivers um, here competing in these leagues, and out of that one being a woman driver, as Akhil mentioned earlier. The, what these cars provide is a very unique driving platform because as their prototypes and are quite, quite entertaining to watch as well. Moving on, Moving on, uh, moving on, we're going to now announce the calendar and the whole reason why we have come for this event. Uh, this, uh, yeah, what, what, really, what really puts us apart and you know, puts us on the world map is also the who we've aligned with because again, the product is key and aligning with someone like uh, Prema Power Team who are like the Ferrari of junior motors, in the junior motorsporting world. It gives us the validation needed to have a long-lasting future. To make it a complete a na a national series, we have to go to the whole country, and we touch up on all the three made in all the three circuits that we have in India, which is the Buddh International Circuit in the Greater Noida. We've got the Hyderabad Street Circuit, which is going to be the epitome of our championship, and then you have the Madras Motors Motor Racing Track, followed by the Kari Motor Speedway in Coimbatore. This truly does make us a national racing championship. So guys, you've seen it all. You've seen the cars, you've seen the circuits. Are you ready to watch the calendar? And then finally, the live action. So are you ready for the next big thing in Indian motorsports? Are you ready for the next big thing? Come Can't on, hear you. Are you ready? Hyderabad, it's time. Uh, Mr. Arman, Mr. Aditya, Mr. Akhilesh, this is something fabulous that you guys are doing. Putting our motorsports on the world map and giving equal chances to men and women uh, in the industry of motorsports. Moving on quickly, it's now time to unveil uh, the calendar. So for that, I would request Mr. Amarnath Garu to kindly step forward and launch the calendar. Mr. Amarnath Garu, please. Once again, I request Mr. Amarnath Garu to kindly come on stage. A huge round of applause, everyone, for Mr. Amarnath Garu. I'll also request him to share a few words with our audience. Gentlemen, it's time to launch our calendar. A huge round of applause because this is going to be the schedule for next year for our championship. For a racing championship.
I'll now request Mr. Aditya Patel to kindly introduce the racers to our event. We would like to now introduce you to the official Blackbirds Hyderabad drivers, Akhil Rabindra and Hyderabad's very own Anandit Reddy. Woohoo! Everyone, a huge round of applause. Guys, you can pull the covers off the cars, show everybody what those beautiful machines look like. The champion racers of India, they are here and they are now unveiling the cars. We, as I said, are going to witness something that you haven't seen before live. Let me add that. It's time to see our racers racing it through the streets of Hyderabad. Once again, everyone, can we have a huge round of applause for our racers right here? And they are going to show you they're going to show you some street racing. Oh my God, I am so excited. I just cannot wait to see what they've got. All right, Hyderabad, are we ready or are we ready? Come on, you have to make some noise. Are we ready, Hyderabad? Yes, that's more like it. And now racers, drivers, it's time for you to put your helmet on and show Hyderabad what we have right here. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on, come on, let's do this. <laughs> Honestly, I'm super thrilled to see what's going to happen here. I request our media team to kindly give us space to move aside so the drivers can take the cars out. I request all the media people to kindly move aside and give some space for our drivers to take the car out. Well, ladies and gentlemen, Akhil and Anandit are getting into the car. Check, check. And I'm Hi, super I request thrilled. all the media to please clear out. We have to start the cars. Can we please request the media to please... Uh, you can stand outside and cover it. We just want everyone to be safe. This is for your own safety. Can we request, please? We want to take the protocol. So I request you all to kindly step back. All the kids, all the guests, I request you all to kindly be seated and step back. Up. 
on ladies and gentlemen brace yourselves up because akhil and anandit are all set and all ready to show you some street racing right away and once again i'll request all the media people and all the guests to kindly give them some space I request everyone to please clear the passage please the cars has to go out this is for safety reasons i request everyone to kindly clear the space security please help us clear the space can we have everyone moved out the cars has to go for the go out I request everyone we have to get this car going if you, guys how many of you want to see this car is going out i'm sure you all are excited right so can we all clear the space media i request you all to kindly cooperate security please uh, help us to clear the space Well, the racers are ready. I hope Hyderabad, you are ready to witness something we all haven't seen before. Also, do not worry. You are not going to miss out on any action because everything will be displayed on the screen. So, in fact, I request everyone to kindly settle down. I'm now going to request Mrs. Rama Garu to kindly step forward and wave the green flag. Mrs. Rama Garu, please step forward and wave the green flag as we are now about to see some street racing action right here, right now. Hyderabad, get ready! And as I said, you're not going to miss any action because everything is going to be displayed on the screen. Formula Regional Indian Championship is here, giving a platform to all the young and talented racers of our country to showcase their talent on a on an international level. Use, use, 
huge round of applause. settle down because all the action is going to be displayed right here on the screen so you might want to take your seats so that everyone can have a look also i will once again have aditya and arman and they will be taking you through the entire event what is going to happen right now on the screen they'll be they'll be telling you all about it thank you so Ladies and gentlemen, that's basically Anand Reddy and Akhil Rabindra driving these fantastic Formula Regional cars on the streets of Hyderabad. Aren't you excited? Don't you think you have one of the best roads in the country? You have two racing cars on your streets right now. That's just absolutely fantastic. Give them a huge round of applause, everybody. That's a sight you don't see so often. Two race cars on the bridge and a boat going underneath. You couldn't have asked for anything better. These cars are capable of reaching speeds of 260 kilometers per hour. They are one of the most technologically advanced race cars in the world right now. You are also watching some of the best race car drivers, not just in India, the two of them are highly regarded and can also be considered as one of the best, if not in the region, then probably in the world. Oh, definitely. I think India produces some of the best drivers, but at least now we have the opportunity for them to prove their talents out there. Absolutely. They are proving themselves in front of all of you right now. And if you're wondering what it's like to be sitting in a race car, you have to think about it. Just imagine yourself sitting down on the floor and moving at speed. Fast, and you need to have a lot of talent. They come around back onto the bridge in this fantastic spectacle but here on the streets of Hyderabad. But guys, the new bridge, and who would have thought? Look at the beautiful scenery. Scenic. Wouldn't you want to be in the car right now? I'm crying inside. I'm crying inside. But I'm so happy that we managed to achieve this. And I think, you know, the organization needs to be given a real hand of applause really helping us and getting all the permissions. City police for helping us make this possible without whom we couldn't have Look done at that, any guys. of this. Look at that. You are witnessing history, ladies and gentlemen. Put your hands together once again. Yeah. Come on, guys, you can do better. Can we hear you? has this ever happened before and coming to you live next year on the streets of Hyderabad official racing series. We would love to see all of you, all of your friends watching the races live in Hyderabad when we come to you in March 2022. You will see these cars and many many more cars in full form. Now we're going to see Anand is ready, pick up some speed, you're watching him go fast through the bridge. Like I said, these cars are capable of speeds of 250 kilometers per hour, and that's what makes it really exciting. More than the top speed, Atya, it's how fast they accelerate, as you can see that, you know? And it's, just, it's how quickly you can go from 0 to 100 and achieve maximum targets through, a far, through the corners. As you see them coming through the left hand of the set, it's so beautiful. It's, it's brilliant. I mean, I don't think I've seen anything like this before in this country. It's fantastic. Aren't you all proud to be citizens of Hyderabad right now? Yes, yes. 
I think this is a really emotional moment for Akhilesh Arya as well because I remember when we first met, he said this was his dream. Yeah, Akhilesh. <laughs> and now the dream has come true, Akhilesh. <laughs> and I think it's a dream come true for the city as well and for the entire motorsport fraternity. I think for the country. To have these cars here, for the country, to have these cars here and to be racing on these streets. Once these drivers are done with this round, they will be back. So I would like everybody to please move from where you're standing, from where the cars were parked. Please give them some space. They will be coming back here. Please do take your seats again as the cars are going to take the checkered flag and drive straight back in here. So I request everyone to space. once again kindly settle down because the cars are going to be back here now. I was about to say, Anandit was absolutely flying on the bridge just now. I think he can't hold it. He just wants to go as fast as he can go. And the cars are on their way back, ladies and gentlemen. Once again, one final time for the drive. Please put your hands together for these two fantastic drivers, Akhil and Anandit. Here they are, they're back. Please move everybody. Please give them some space to bring the cars in. Drivers are back and I would now request Mrs. Sudha Garu and Mr. Krishna Garu to wave the checkered flag. I request Mrs. Sudha Garu and Mr. Krishna Garu to wave the checkered flag. Our drivers are back. History has been created in our very own city of Hyderabad. We request Sudagaru to please come for the checkered flag, Mrs. Sudagaru. I request everyone to kindly clear the space. Uh, we have to put the cars back. Request all the media friends to please step back. I'll uh, request everyone to kindly settle down. We want the drivers to come back in. We need to put the cars back and continue with our event. So everybody, please take your seats again. And I'll request people standing near the car to also move aside so that we can get some space to put the cars back. I request everyone to please clear the space. We have to take the car inside. I request all our media friends to kindly cooperate and step back. All our media friends, it's a humble request. Please step back a little.
I request all our media friends to please step back. Friends and family, please step back. I request all the guests and media to please come inside uh, and take your seats. Once again, I request all the friends, family and media friends to please come inside and take your seats. If we can quickly come inside and take our seats. Check. I request uh, everyone to quickly take their seats so that we can continue with the event. Everyone, please kindly take your seats. Well, Hyderabad is the first city in India that has witnessed streetcar racing. And I have to tell you, I am super proud to be here, to be a part of a historic event. want to come inside uh, for the media interaction, the media and everyone? Yes. All right, once again, everybody, everyone here, uh, I request you to kindly step inside, take your seats because we have to continue the event. I request everyone standing outside to kindly step inside. We are going to continue with our event. And please take your seats, everybody, please take your seats. Check, check. Himani. Thank you so much, everybody, for joining us here today. Um, media interaction is now going to happen outside, so I request the media people to step forward and do the interviews for the We Are Now Open for Q&A round. And all our guests, all our audience, thank you so very much um, for joining us here today, for being a part of this historic moment. It's a super, super proud moment for India, for Hyderabad, for all of us. My name is Imani Singh. I would like